What's up, everybody? This is Ebb Friday, and you are now rocking with Motion King Studios. Um, today, I just wanted to do a quick tutorial to uh, show you guys my workflow when I color grade. Um, you are looking at a um, clip of my brother, Daniel. Everybody say hi to Daniel. All right. So um, basically, um, this was shot on the Red Scarlet X. When you shoot your footage, you offload it. This is what it looks like. Um, it is shot on the gamma curve red gamma four, and you can choose to leave it as is, or you can choose to change the gamma curve to red log film, which changes your image to a, a flat image where you have total control over, you know, what you want to do with this image. And basically this is what I like to do. I want full control on, you know, on the color grade, the way the image looks, the sharpening, the contrast, etc. So we're gonna go to the color panel now, and um, in this first node, I am gonna be uh, using the Vision Color Osiris LUTs, and we're gonna go to, we're gonna right click on the node, we're gonna go to 3D LUT, we're gonna go to Log, and M31. Okay, so if we zoom into this. There's a couple of things I want to change in this image. Um, for one, it looks a little saturated. So we're just going to change the saturation, change it to 40. And we're going to go to this key panel. And basically the key, it controls the output of the current node. I, you know, I want to take down some of this uh, LUT effect. So I'm just going to change this to 0.8, take that down a little bit and that's looking great. Okay, so for my next node, I'm going to add another node. I'm going to go to uh, node, add serial node, and we're going to add some contrast to this image. Basically, we're going to make the blacks blacks and the whites whites. So we're going to go to the lift, and we're just going to bring the lift down. And I'm working off of two screens right now, so my waveform monitor is on the other screen. So you guys, you know, when you color grade or color correct, you always want to be looking at your waveform monitors. It's very important. Okay, so we're going to bring down the blacks. Then we're going to bring up the gain or the whites. Bring that up. And we're going to bring up the gamma a little bit. Okay. So let's take a look at that. All right. And this will be before the contrast. And this will be after. Looks great. All right, so the next thing I want to do is I'm going to add a new serial node. And we want to bring some attention to his face. Okay, so we're going to go to the power windows. We're going to go to the power circular window. And we're just going to drag it over his face. Close it in a little bit. And we're going to feather it out. And we want to bring the background down. So if you... in in order to do that, you are going to have to invert this uh, power window. So we're going to click on invert and we're just going to bring down the highlights a little bit. We're going to bring down the gamma and turn that off. And let's take a look at the before and after. Okay. So this is before the power window and this is after. So basically it just draws your eyes into his face and that's what we want. Okay. And the last thing I want to do is I'm going to add a new node and we're just going to sharpen this image up a little bit. Okay, so for my sharpening, I usually stay anywhere from 45 to 47. So I'm going to I'm going to leave it at 45 and let's take a look. So this will be before the grade. And this will be after the grade. Before. After. Okay, and it's uh, that simple, guys. So um, thanks for checking out my tutorial. Please subscribe for more videos. Um, shout out to my brother, Daniel. Uh, follow me on Instagram at Ebb Friday. And uh, see y'all later.